Very good day to you people. My name is Mohit and guys today I'll talk about how to play audio on your web page. Now playing audio is uh, pretty much easy guys except uh, for the preparation that needs to be done uh, up front. Okay. Uh, usually we'll need three formats. We'll need the AUG format, the AUG WABES format, the WAV format and the MP3 format uh, before we can actually you know, upload the files onto your hosting server. And why do we need all these three formats? Guys, the reason is very simple. Uh, all the browsers don't play all the formats. You see, uh, most of them will either play the AUG or the WAV or the MP3. Okay, So, it will try AUG first failing which will try the WAV and um, then it will fall back to the MP3. Okay, uh, So on and so forth. That's the reason why we need uh, multiple formats uh, while uh, using audio on your web pages. Now let's check the code uh, right in front of you. This code uh, that I've used on my website guys. The website is um, adobe cs5.in forward slash whindex.html. You can see the link uh, down there in the description. You can check. You can test it out uh, yourself. Okay. So it's a very easy code. What you need to do is guys you need to use the audio tag in the body element. Okay. You have Dreamviewer open in front of you, uh, of you guys. Uh, I've used the audio tag and then I've used the attributes autoplay and uh, the loop. I can also use the attribute control guys. If I say controls and uh, make it equal to controls, uh, then what will happen? I'll be able to see the player as well. Okay, The play pause button, the mute button, the volume up and down button. You will be able to manipulate the volume and the controls. But uh, I wouldn't want that. At least... Uh, not in my case okay I don't want the controls I'm getting rid of it you can try with the controls as well okay so all the three formats the awkward format the wave format the mp3 format are lying in the local site folder guys this is the way you write the code these are the attributes that you pass in in the opening audio tag this is the closing audio tag it'll uh, the browser will first try to play the org warbus then the wave then the mp3 okay usually it should be able to play uh, any of the three formats very easily shouldn't have a problem and just in case uh, the audio tag does not work with your browser which is again very rare most uh, modern browsers should be able to play it then uh, I've used the embed code as well okay the embed tag and I have passed in the mp3 file there okay and failing which failing which failing line number 127 again pretty rare it will display a message which says your browser does not play audio so all very easy guys not too difficult barely a few lines of um, HTML and you should be good to go so uh, let me test it up in the browser okay so a preview in Chrome first let me increase the volume All right. This is right from uh, w3schools.com, and uh, they say that currently there are three main formats for the audio element. You can use the AUG WABES, the MP3, and the WAV. This is the browser compatibility chart, guys. All right. So as you can see, the WAV format is played in most browsers, and uh, the next one, I think, the m more popular one is the AUG WABES. Okay guys, uh, one more thing that uh, I would like to point out to you that I've used the free mp3 WMA OGG converter to convert all my sounds. It's very easy. It's absolutely free. I got it from uh, I got it from filehippo.com and uh, all you need to do is you need to just add the files here and then you need to click on the next button and it it's a breeze guys it, it's, it's a few seconds and you are done you can um, convert your audios as well as your videos <coughs> excuse me all right guys so I hope you uh, learned something good and useful you would implement it on your projects I'll see you very soon with yet another dream weaver uh, tutorial it could be flash with action script 3 peace